Bam, and welcome back to War... Uh, not Warhammer. Uh, welcome back to Tabs. Uh, we are continuing with the custom Warhammer campaign, uh, part two. Big job to Sartosa. Uh, explains the pirates in Sylvania. Uh, have to go to a port in the Westerlands. Strange. If I bring up the direct land route to Tilia, Sam goes rigid like a statue and mutters weird words like DLC. Uh, port it is. Oh, Jesus. That's a lot of dudes. Well, I guess these are the bandits. Okay, they've got guns. They've got horses. A lot of archers. Okay. Well... Oh, we get to go pretty far forward. What do we want, like a phalanx? Wow, that's not even like that many points. Uh, okay, they might do good against the cav. And then after that, maybe like a Zeus or two. And then a thousand buckaroos. Swordcaster? Why not? Let's just like see, see how this goes. Uh, okay, right, yeah, instantly forgot about the guns. Guns are bad. Ooh. And the phalanx just did nothing. Uh, I thought they were going to work really well against the horses, but I guess not. Okay, uh, this looks like it could work, but they've got so many ranged troops that we're never going to be able to take all of them down with just, like, our chod. Oh my god, wow. I say that as a lightning bolt just chain lightning through so many of them. Luckily, a lot of their troops seem to be very distracted. Uh, so we've got two Law of Heavens mages and... Ooh. Uh, well, not that guy. Okay, this could work amazingly. Um, actually, archers hate being zeus Okay, pretty good. Oh my god. You have such a small head. Like, does that make you better at shooting or worse? Only it's worse. Big eyes is what you need. Oh man, this is not what you want. Oof. He's dead. Merc versus Merc. The vampires and Sartosans are in cahoots, searching for an artifact, something magical. A professional army blocks the road, paid off with pirate booty, no doubt. Uh, okay, professional army. They've got a load of swords. They've got some spiky boys, little guns. Okay, right, I like this. They've got like little Warhammer units. These are these are kind of cool. A unit of cav, uh, some arty, general at the back. Nice. Uh, Okay, I feel like we just want, like, our own gun line. Just super arty it up. Let's let's just try and pull them apart, old school style. And when I say old school style, I mean ballistas. Do we want Huachas? Just to, like, thin out the ranks a little bit. Maybe a couple of the old, the old catapults. And then we just need stuff to, like, just distract them, I guess. Okay, right. I, I, I kind of like this as a build. I don't think it's going to go too well. Uh, ooh, right, that, there was an explosion where I think a cannon just shot his own boys. Uh, okay, our, our brawlers are not going to hold up long. And I think we've got maybe a tad too much arty. They all shot the exact same thing and absolutely annihilated those units, but there's too many guys to get in. Ooh. Yeah, our chord has fallen. The the Huachas are kind of junk. I don't really rate Huachas. Like, they're just too random. Against, like, big guys, maybe. They do a lot of damage. Well, our artillery train got annihilated. That's a sad day for everyone. And you know what? We're going old school. I know how much you guys love cheerleaders. Chat is literally pissing their pants. Okay. I just like these, like, big ranked-up units. They just look so much fun to shoot with artillery. That's that's this whole plan. Uh, although the horses. Horses are bad. Okay. Uh, actually, like, having so many blisters doesn't feel so good. They all are targeting the same guys too much. We really need, like, a spread of firepower. Uh, okay, the Valkyries are almost all defeated now. Ooh, ballistas firing a volley. There's still a horse standing, which doesn't feel good. Uh-oh. There's two horses. We are we are doomed. Yeah, I don't think... Oh. Oh, maybe. If we can kill that other horse, I reckon that we can... can pull these guys apart. They've got a lot of range back there, though. Oh, my 
my god, how did he dodge that? Lazla Neo-esque ballista dodging. Ooh. And only a few of my boys left. Oh, the fan bearer's defeated. Uh, right. Ballistas. Kinda doing the work. Muskets can snipe them from range, but no, we, we've just pulled them apart. What the hell? Who would have thought? Ballistas. Ooh, the Westerland port. Norse are pillaging the port, sir. Uh, if we intervene, we may pick up some extra booty and reduce the fare to Sartosa. Attack! Oh, they've got like a beast man minotaur over there. Just a bunch of regular, regular dudes. If we, if we just go heavy on one side. God, we've got to be careful of him though. What's the new plan? Like, Berserkers, kind of tough. How many raptors does it take to kill a Minotaur? Oh. Uh, there goes uh, Yuskas Rapto. And all the other raptors. Super getting involved. Uh, the boat has goofed up. Oh, they killed this one. Before the boat got thrown. That is... Unexpected. Uh, how's the Minotaur? Uh, Minotaur's dead. We only lost... Oh god, like four... Five raptors. But now, the the hordes, like, look at this, like, tidal wave. Uh-oh, they've got shouters. Oh, that bone mage. Okay, the raptors have done awfully. Uh, okay, they, they did not work the way we were hoping they would. Ooh, okay. Gotta be better. Teachers. Because teachers are a bit like fences, right? They've got, like, a bit of tricksiness. Just so. Give me some muskets as well. Like, muskets, definitely one of my mainstay troop choices these days. Jousters? Halberdiers? How about just more muskets? Man, is like, muskets and fences. That seems to be my new... My new go-to. Can we... Oh my god, is this... 10,000 IQ. Bait those guys to jumping off the wall. See ya! Okay, that guy just instantly made his points back. Ooh, they almost made it back. Uh, okay, not quite sure how this went, but I'm guessing it was Musket shot the Minotaur. Oh man, the fences are so good, like, with that little, like, poke jab attack. It feels really accurate, where, like, loads of other people are super clumsy with how they fight. Uh, okay, don't everyone fire at once at the same target, please. That's gonna be a waste of shots. Man, once again, fences just doing the business. Okay, firing down the street. Oh, I can't believe the bone mage got got it off. Uh, ooh, I don't know if our gun line is gonna be able to hold this alleyway. Uh, especially when we have no meat left to distract them. Although the boat could block them. Oh my god, the teacher actually killed him. Ooh, okay. Uh, it was, he was really cold. It's gonna be fine. I doubt it hurt that much. Okay, that boat is doing great work for us, but... We could get out archered here, because they can fire over a bit better than we can. Uh, shit, this doesn't feel good. Oh, one down. We definitely have the numbers, but they've got the speed. They've got, like, the, the DPS. No. Oh, hello. Come on. Uh, although, this boat is going to be a problem, because the moment it goes down, those three oarsmen get off, and we will die. Oh, wait, they shot one of the oarsmen. <gasps> oh, my God, that volley. Man, musketmen. I am so into them. Norse is the worse. Merchants of Marienburg will pay for the destruction of the Norse raiding force camp. I told them I'm on a mission for the Emperor himself. That loosened their purse strings. Okay, 18,000 bucks. They've got some big guys, a load of berserkers. It's just like a bit of everything. They do have a horse. Okay, wow, they've got a couple of horses. And a dragon. Huh. Can't go wrong with 25 musketeers. Look, we'll take our, like, little line of fences as well. Maybe, like, little units of fences. A couple of... They've got big guys, so... Although earlier I was like, I hate Huachars. Maybe Huachars are good now. Because it's actually against, like, mammoths and giants and stuff. They're pretty, pretty legit. Okay, 
bold strategy here. Like, he'll definitely die soon. If he can kill that before he dies, he can he can take down a lot of dudes. Maybe even take two. Like, have one back a little bit. Great. Oh, did he get instantly flamed? No, he's all right. Okay. Ooh, did the calf? Uh-oh, they've got stuff in my back lines. Shit, the muskets all fired at the berserkers when they were jumping, um, which is absolutely the last thing I wanted to have happen. Uh, oh, there's a tree musketman. Uh, you guys better reload soon because you're about to die. Oh, look at his tiny head. I love the tiny heads. Uh, right, one sensei is definitely going down. Both senseis are definitely going down. There's a very brave fencer going in. Oh god, like too many, too many berserkers made it into my back line. I needed like anti-berserker troops to uh, take them down. Doesn't look terrible. We've got a Huacha that could kill a giant. Not with shots like that. Uh, there are, the berserkers are what I'm kind of most scared of, but I should be scared of this giant. Donk. Okay, right. We had our placements all set up badly. We want to trigger the guys to jump. And maybe we even have the muskets further back so they don't fire too early. You know, I have some calf. Just sow some, like, madness. You know, the more carnage, the more time we've got just to, like, shoot into there. And I think... Oh, I don't know how good a Zeus is going to be in this fight, but they've got some, like, little blobs. It could be okay. And take a blister as well. I'm not sure why the blister is on the front ranks. That seems like a terrible play, but it's our play. Uh, and then, last of all, have some more halflings just to try and aggro. Okay, right. Are these guys firing? Oh no, they fired too early. Okay. It. Their hordes are being loosely trimmed. The muskets aren't engaged in the big fight, which is exactly what I want. Hwachars firing into the enemy. Uh, we're running out of meat. Uh oh, we do have a berserker in our ranks. But Zeus, just kill that berserker. That one berserker. Where are you going? Oh god, Zeus. He's betrayed us. Uh, Hwachar could kill a mammoth. Very nice. Uh... Okay, the guns feel strong. Uh, that giant will probably go down. Oh god, if the Huachars would just stay on target for once. Nice. Oh, good job. I'm sorry I complained at you, Huachars. You were doing great. You were just having like a party time. Maybe it was this dude who wanted to be a Huachar firer instead. Island plunder. Marienburg paid. More money for recruits now. Resume journey. Notice the lonely island. Simone won't weird on me again. You'll receive a measly loot if you wait. But land now and the road will be great. You may have to face an enemy army though. Wow. Okay, so we found like one of the, um, you know, uh, zombie islands. What is this? Like, there's a load of pirates? We've got 7,000 bucks. What have they got? Pistols, skeletons, some clams, which are kind of spooky. Vamps, cannons. Ah, uh, this is like a pretty pretty good setup. I feel like some Zeus's would do great here. I don't know how good, like, muskets will be. There's just so many of them. We're, like, after, like, horde clearing. Pirate Queen. Everyone comes in. Pirate Queen's around. And then we just need some minor distractions for cannons and stuff. Let's see how this goes. Uh, they've got guns, which the Pirate Queen doesn't like being shot a lot. But... Oh my god, wow. The Zeus's instantly... Doing just great electrical work. Pirate Queen is scared. Not good. One of the cannons killed itself. Okay. Uh, there's clams. There's a lot of clams. Uh, and Zeus is getting shot up a bit. But this hero ball that we've made. Another classic Warhammer build. Zeus, come on. You're just lightning the boxes. Wood is terrible at conducting. Oh, is it just the clams? The most terrifying monster of all. Clams. Uh, oh. Oh, I guess Barrel Boy. Wow, Barrel Boy really takes a lot of lightning. 
man, we did it. Island re-plunder. Sartosans and vampires and more. Sighted off the west. Maybe this wasn't such a great idea. I'm saying that a lot these days. Right, they've got the kamikaze bomb boys who are definitely very dangerous. Uh, they've got a big cannon who we can use to our own advantage. A bunch of vamps. A pirate king. Uh, we just want, like, good troops. Although, first of all, we need garbage troops. What about skeletons? Because the bombs are kind of going to blow themselves up. And then if we have... Right, we're going to be sensible. Tankier, because these guys will tank and then get bombed by them. That sounds great. A single brawler, right in the middle. He'll probably just get shot, but... I'm just hoping the berserkers kind of make it in. They're going to get scared by spooky skeletons. I was hoping they'd kill muskets. Uh, unfortunately, not to be... Okay, the Jarls kind of held up pretty good. And the longer the Jarls are doing stuff, it, the more time Artemis has to... Oh, God. Wow. Everything dies so quickly. Ugh. Okay, Artemis is not pulling her weight at all. Let's see if a cheerleader... Let's see if a cheerleader does it. Maybe she just needs to be firing faster. Like, you're investing points. Why not invest a few more points? I guess because they've got artillery and we are not killing stuff fast enough. Uh, okay, right. Our cheerleader is down. One of their cannons is dead. Okay. Oh, right. They're in. Another cannon is down. This could be good. They literally have, like, a skelly, a musket, and uh, just a barrel boy. Barrel boy's down. Oh, buddy. That's what you get for joining the pirates. Oh, it's me, Fito. What a great series of battles these are. A bit warhammery, a bit tabsy. It's got it all. What a great time. Oh, don't forget to put a comment in the comment section. You guys are doing amazing, helping out the algorithm. Apparently, if you put fun words in, like, I like this video, and this is a fun video, maybe that helps. It's not entirely proven, but we had some little inside hints on that. Maybe that works. Who knows? Try it out. Goodbye.